Perhaps I should feel some twinge of guilt at all I have done, but I've had little time for scruples. It was once an honor to be entombed within these ancient catacombs, but centuries have passed, uh, and now only the brave or foolhardy walk these tunnels. Perhaps I'm the last living soul here, although I'm far from alone. This is not my story, although I am the architect of what transpires. A conspirator in the ruination that threatens the heretic kingdoms. And the most unlikely of alliances that might yet save us all. And mas inca sera dilbarana. Thou summons me. What is thy pact? I seek only that we shall both survive. Thou hast a liar's tongue and cannot be trusted. I do not ask you to trust me, nor should you. I would betray you without hesitation, if I deemed it necessary. But we are fortunate, you and I. We have the same enemies. Our only hope lies in partnership, which is precisely why I have summoned you here, demon. You were summoned without a pact, so whichever soul you devour will now bind you to a path beyond anyone's control. Choose wisely, demon. Jaska, the wild boar. A great hero in our native land of Corwin. He fell in battle over a decade ago in the Accession Wars against the wolf tribes of Temuria. A hunter, a loner, and an unparalleled archer. He also dabbled in the skills of an undead slaver. Choose Jaska if you wish the mobility and deadly aim of one of the greatest... Kali. They called him the Bandit King, a warrior and a mercenary. He led the Guild of Steel in Poe. Sadly for Kallig, he trusted his own son a little more than he could afford. Some called him a barbarian, but few lived who did so. Choose Kallig if you wish the might and fortune. Devia, the daughter of fire, a princess of the Imperial Garulian Empire. She would have been God Empress if she had not rebelled. She died on the Reliquary Crusade three centuries ago. I don't know how. A mage with incredible potential. She had not only harnessed the elemental power of flame, but also learned the mysterious ways of the Sand Mage. Choose Evia if you... Did I... Am I dead? What is this place? I know not of this place, but thou art indeed dead. That soul is mine! Uh, 
This cannot be! Mother, is this your revenge? Can you hear me, daughter of fire? I can. Do you remember the reliquary crusade? Do you recall how you died? Lady Mara, Taryn, and the others. We were raiding my mother's vault in order to defeat her. I do not remember what happened. Taryn betrayed you, but I never learned what transpired. This mystery is yours to solve, I'm afraid. Do not speak as if I am not present, mortals. Patience, demon. Your fate is bound to Evia's now, as is my own. Now make haste to the city of Thal that lies above this crypt. A cenotaph can transport you there. Our fates are bound together, demon. Either we shall find a way to survive together, or we shall both surely perish. Thou threatens me? No. Something far more dangerous than I threatens us all. Join me in the Tholian Arcanum as soon as you can. We have much to discuss. Are the catacombs beneath Thor, yet they are in ruins. Thou dost not fear me? I'm a princess of the Imperial family. I fear no demon. Thou shouldst fear me. Thy soul is mine. <laughs> you keep telling yourself that.
tremble before a princess of the Gerulian throne. Much more of this. This must be the Cenotaph the Hooded Man spoke of. Its power breaches shadow. There is much I might do here. This Cenotaph is erected upon the graves of many dead mortals. It shall be easy to gate weave back to this place should I find another such monument. And I sense a gate here already. The Hooded Man's work, mayhap. It must be the way out he mentioned. <laughs> 